the suspension. It's got coilovers. And you're running what, 33s? All right, so of course we got my Jeep over here. Well guys, there it is. I'm just outside of the house here and <laughs> got it all open up because I'm actually going to clean up the inside and take some stuff out. But I just cleaned the Jeep and then I washed the trailer. Looks pretty cool. Hey, what's going on YouTube? So we're back with another video. We're going to go camping today and we are taking the trailer. And I'm just at the... Uh, I'm just at the grocery store getting a bunch of stuff with my buddy Tyler. It's his birthday today, so we're going to go and do a little bit of fishing and uh, uh, do some camping. This thing is coming out so nicely. Can't wait to show you guys a little bit more of what's going on uh, with this trailer. But stay tuned because this is going to be a fun one. Okay, so we are in Sedalia, Colorado, and we're just waiting for our buddy Kobe to show up. And I got my buddy Tyler with me. What's up, guys? Hey, hey. And um, it's his birthday today, so everyone say happy birthday to him in the comment section. And we're gonna, we, we're probably about 30 minutes away from the spot we wanna camp. Um, and we don't know if we're gonna camp there yet, but uh, it looks like a probability. And uh, we're gonna get some fishing done, but it's pretty dang windy today. So it's always windy when I'm recording for some reason. I know some of you guys have complained about the wind noise, but I try to do the best I can with what I have, so. Um, but anyways, we're waiting for Kobe. As soon as he gets here, we're gonna hit the road. And uh, but for now, I'm gonna show you the trailer because it looks pretty sick. And uh, shout out to the guy at King Supers. Thanks for watching our videos, and uh, we hope to see you on the trail. Okay, so we just pulled off uh, on the side of the road here, I'm waiting for our buddy. Here, here's my Jeep. You guys already know my Jeep. And look at the trailer. It tows really nicely. Uh, I got the solar panel already going so hopefully um i gotta actually this has to go back a little bit so that we can get the full power uh we can get the full sun sunlight on it anyways but i'm already all packed out i mean this thing is fully fully loaded i got the yeti cooler in there we got blankets we got tents got chairs got everything else in there um, I'm still working on the fender situation. I don't know if I'm gonna do fenders or not. One of the biggest obstacle is this uh, little water inlet. I'm having issues with, um, you know, the fender has to be sitting high up. So I don't know if that's just gonna stay under it. I, I'm not sure yet, so. But check out these racks. So my dad and I had to kind of rig it to make it fit on top of the trailer. But uh, it's doing pretty good. And it tows really nicely with my JK. Even with my wife's JL, it tows really nicely, so. Cool. Ladies, this guy is single. No. You better hit him up. No, yes, he is single and searching. <laughs> All right, so Kobe's here now in a sweet looking truck. What's up? And if anybody got a shirt for this guy, let us know. <laughs> and we got Remy with us today. Hey. Look how beautiful she is. Oh, she's just beautiful. <laughs> well, look at this guy. He's all hooked up. Looks like he's got some black rhinos. And uh, look at the suspension. He's got coilovers. And you're running what, 33s? 35s, nice, dude. Sweet, the truck looks great, six inch lift. Maybe we'll do a walk through this thing at camp. All right, let's go. <laughs> yeah, every, this is Kobe, everyone. Best friend. <laughs> but no, no, sorry Tyler, you're my best friend. <laughs> we can share a 50-50 but around 50 up to one. <laughs> Alright, let's go, let's get on the road. Have you guys ever been down this road before? Yeah. I've never been on this road. Yeah, I've been on it a couple times, a couple trails around here where I take the Jeep. Yeah, I'm glad we picked this spot. It looks really pretty. I bet the river is going to be awesome, too. Yeah, man, you picked the right place. Oh, look at that view. Gorgeous. That's just incredible. That is gorgeous. How cool is this? It looks like a big tree house here. If I can get the glare to see. There we go. Look at this tree house. 
Now that's a tree house right there. Cool. <laughs> this road just keeps getting more and more awesome. All right, so I believe we found the uh, the spot. So we're gonna get down and check it out. Oh man, it's so beautiful over here. So guys, the thing was a trooper, so I'm pretty happy about how it handled. And uh, I got my buddy right here, man. Look at this guy. <laughs> He's single, ladies. Get him. <laughs> All right, so let's check out the water. Let's uh, set up for camp. I think we we'll do some fishing. Uh, maybe we'll eat some food or wait for dinner. I don't know. If I catch a fish, that's going to be lunch. So, man, this place is beautiful. Let me show you. Check out the water. It's just, man, this is gorgeous. Remy's having a great old time over there. <laughs> yeah, sorry we couldn't bring Milo today. He's at home with the wife. Today it's about the boys. Let's get some fishing done. All right, so we decided to keep going. We're gonna find a better spot. Um, just because I don't know that we can camp here, so we'll just keep going. All right. All right, so I think we're just gonna move on to another spot, something a little bit more secluded. Uh, farther from the road we're just right next to the road and I don't like that so I need to do the guys so we're gonna keep going and see if we can find a better spot now that the last this is a be very beautiful spot and I would like to stay here but we'll see let's go So we're just on the side of the road here and uh, we're just gonna check the map, see if we can find another spot to camp. Um, a lot of people are out today and there's just not a whole lot available. Left of this area going forward, we're going to break with some of those badass chicken wings if we wanted. It's not too far away now. Um, but we can keep our eye out on the left. Um, since we're in National Forest, any of this is gonna be fair game. Let's do it. Yeah, this area is gorgeous. I've driven down the opposite way from here and spent a little bit of time over here, uh, but this is all just beautiful land. Okay, so apparently these are the best chicken wings in the world, according to Tyler. So we're gonna go to this restaurant bar thing. And from the looks of it, there's a lot of people already waiting, so. All right, got our own parking. <laughs> I didn't fit up there with the trailer and all the cars up there, so. Let's go check out this place. See how good it is. There's another one of you. <laughs> All right, those wings were extremely good. Shout out to uh, this place here in Zocas. That's pretty good. So now we're gonna get going. We're gonna try to find a place to camp. We're still on the search for it. So best places are usually found when you don't have a plan. So let's go. I think we found our spot here somewhere. We're gonna keep driving. Uh, it looks like Kobe is pretty excited about. Uh, well, his his goal is to find somewhere across the river, and uh, or just somewhere right next to the river. I mean, uh, away from the crowd. So see if we can find something around here. I'll keep you guys updated. I think Remy has something to tell us. What is it, Remy? <laughs> All right, so we just pulled up to camp and uh, we found a good spot. <laughs> um, we're just setting up right now. 
and uh, it's pretty darn windy i'm sorry every time i record videos it seems like it's windy here but hope you guys can put up with it i'm gonna show you our setup real quick all right so of course we've got my jeep over here we've got tyler getting his fly rod ready we're gonna go do some fishing and we have the uh trailer semi setup <coughs> i got this side already deployed so got my sink set up we got the cooler that's full of drinks and then got our fly rods getting those ready i didn't want to set up the tent just yet just because it's so windy so i'm gonna try to see if the wind would die down a little bit so i can set that up and show you guys what that looks like my friend kobe and his truck already set up here and uh, looks like the solar panel is getting enough sunlight to charge up that battery and that's just a marine grade battery that I have in there. Um, I just tried some of the lights and everything else works just fine. So I think we'll be fine. Again, this is my first time trying this thing out and I'm sorry about all the wind. Yeah. <laughs> so look how clear the water is. It's gorgeous. Ready, ready? Let's do it. Let's get some fish. All right, so I haven't had any luck with the uh, any fish at all. And I've already lost a couple flies, so going back to the trailer, grab something to drink. I'm gonna go back and try again. All right, it looks like Kobe's having a little bit of a struggle trying to set up his kite of a tent on the floor. It a tent. It's, a kite. <laughs> it's a parachute, man. <laughs> uh, I've attached tent clips to pull for you. No, I could have told you that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Hang on, let me put a shirt on if you're gonna. It's not going so well here. <laughs> I'm learning. <laughs> it's not going so well for Kobe. <laughs> Progress. Nice. <laughs> Here you go. Weird. I guess. Leave him alone, all right? <laughs> Whichever one you want, huh? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> no! The dog! Get the dog! Good. You got what you <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let's get serious now. <laughs> so before all the uh we lose all the sunlight well, i'm gonna start setting up my tent as well and uh just getting ready for the night i'm super pumped let's see how tonight's gonna work out it's kind of windy so i'm kind of bummed out about that but we can't do much about it so. all right oh god no looks like tyler's got his set up over here but it's not really working too well how's it going buddy it's going great all right Remy is too sad because she's tied up. So, anyways, gotta let you go. The music's too loud. I think that'll work. That'll work. Yes, sir. <laughs> All right, so I try to get a lot a time lapse for you guys, but um, my phone didn't want to record. So, here you go. Here's my setup. Sorry about all the movement. But here's my setup uh, on the trailer. It looks pretty cool. So I've had this tent for a few years now. This is my uh, free spirit recreation tent. And uh, this is when they were still making, this was actually the last model that they made with the Jeep um, logo on it. And it's pretty cool. Uh, this is their three person tent. So anyways, I'll be sleeping very comfortably tonight.
All right, I'm just gonna record now that it's not that windy. We got Tyler here, we got Remy digging a hole for no reason. And uh, there's my camp set up over there. There's uh, Kobe's truck. And then here we got Tyler's setup and then Kobe right next to him. And then we're right next to the river, so it's gonna be a really nice, uh, we're gonna have a really nice night of sleep. Kobe's gonna get the fire going. And there's a few other people camping in this area. Uh, Is that your food? Christmas tree? Yeah. Let me get, let me get Mm, it smells really good. So the wind starting to pick up again. It was already nice and calm and things were starting to look up. We we're actually having a really nice conversation there for a minute, but then the wind just came out of nowhere, uh, just a big gust of wind. And uh, so now we we're waiting on the steaks to cook and I'm boiling up some water to get some chicken dumplings going to go with, uh, with our steaks. And that's all we got. So um, we're gonna, we're gonna have a good night of sleep. I just hope it doesn't uh, get too windy tonight because I'm gonna sleep in the tent and uh, uh, you can see some of the ground tents are starting to fly away. So keep you updated. You can definitely test for it. Yeah. So our steaks are looking pretty good. Test it out. Uh, yeah. We got birthday boy testing it out. Yum, yum. Oh, that's looking good. Kind of. Let me see. Let me see if we can put it. Hey, that's, oh, that's all right. Those are pretty done. Yeah, they are. Oh, there is no blood in them. It's weird. So I got my chicken and dumplings here, and then. Oh, shoot. I think. No, no, no. We're good. Yeah, I think the seal's still in there. So just going to pour some water in here. So this is gonna go well with our steaks, hopefully. Chicken and steak, right? 
I'm kind of using my solar panel. Don't judge me, all right? I'm just using my solar panel here for, uh, to, sorry, I'm using my uh, solar panel here um, as a platform to hold my, my burner just because it was pretty windy on that side, so the fire was just going out every time, so. Anyways, I'm gonna shake this up real nicely. This is just a mountain house, chicken and dumplings. Uh, little dry meal, so. This will be right in about 15 minutes. Let's do it. Good steak? Let's get it. Awesome. I don't know, let's ask Remy. Remy? How, how is it? Is that good? Um, that good, huh? No, you can't have the dumplings. No That looks good. I get that. Mm -hmm. That's a spoiled dog. Alright, so it's about 10 o'clock at night and we decided to call it at night. So I'm inside the rooftop tent and uh, got my sleeping bag and a few other things in here. And um, we're just going to call it a night. And tomorrow morning, we're probably going to wrap up early, head back. I don't think we're going to do breakfast in the morning because uh, we'll probably have to go to church early in the morning. So um, we're going to head back home right around like 7 o'clock or so. We're going to wake up at 6 o'clock, wrap everything up, and get going. So good night until tomorrow. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Well, it's the next day here, and we're just gonna start wrapping things up and calling it a day, going back to the city. Well, I've counted last night two geese, two geese went that way, and then this morning I heard four geese pulled up through that way. Turkey yeah. languages. You go like, like these, and then like you go, and then the the turkey like wouldn't come out of the tree. So he said, "I got a trick for this." And he hung up in the tree. Then he took his hat off and he like brings it down low and he goes, <laughs> <laughs> and like like the turkey, like the female turkey comes out of the tree and then like the feathers are flying and it. <laughs> Hits the ground, <laughs> so then the turkey's looking around like. So I slept pretty good last night at Tet 4. There was a couple times where I think I was too hot. And uh, the sleeping bag I brought was just a little overkill for what we were doing. But the tent usually stays pretty warm unless you open the windows. But So I would open the windows once in a while and I would feel cold. So then I would close it again and then I would start sweating. So I didn't like it. But overall, I'm pretty happy. Let me show you. So the setup was pretty, I'm pretty happy with it. The, uh, the sink worked extremely well. It's nothing fancy, but you know, it does what it's supposed to do. And tent works pretty good. The roof rack worked extremely well. Um, solar panels charging the battery, so I was happy about that. And it tows really nicely behind the Jeep. Can't even tell it's there sometimes. Um, other than that, it's just the perfect size for this tent. We have enough storage in there. I just gotta figure out a whole new rail system for the um, 
uh, for the cooler or fridge, whatever I'm gonna do, because it kind of sucks to have to be pulling it out, pulling it back in, especially when it's um, loaded and heavy. Um, again, the fender situation. I do think I am gonna do fenders, and then these uh, stabilizer legs really helped last night. I slept really comfortably in there. Okay, now I'm just gonna put the tent away and we're gonna get going. Uh, you guys are already putting theirs away. It's such a beautiful morning. It's nice and warm. It's not cold, it's not hot either. It's just perfect, so. Up and uh, we'll be ready to go, so we're gonna go ahead and get going. All right, we had a pretty good night of camp. Um, I think everybody had a good night of sleep, except for me, <laughs> but. We had a little bit of rain last night and that was uh, that was pretty awesome. Um, I've never camped in the rain. So it rained for a good, I'll say what, 20, 30 minutes, yeah. And and then it stopped. Um, and then the geese in the morning, <laughs> it was one flying around right about four in the morning. And then two others right around like six and 6.30. So that was my alarm clock to get up. <laughs> but. Uh, I slept pretty comfortably in the tent and I'm pretty happy with I'm pretty happy with the trailer I think there's only a few changes I'm gonna make um, and one of them being the cooler situation I gotta get that figured out pulling that in now it's just it's just a lot of work so <clears throat> I think it's because of the carpet that I installed inside the trailer um, so I gotta figure that out but that's one thing and the other thing is um, I broke my ladder my telescoping ladder so I'm gonna have to get that fixed up and other than that everything else worked out pretty nice Lee Tyler and George's birthday he didn't have a birthday cake he had birthday steak <laughs> which is better back in the city so now it's time to give it a good wash so we can store it back in the garage until next adventure but this is a lot of fun it for this video thank you so much for watching as you can see we're back in the house we got the trailer back inside the garage thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe like this video and comment because i love i love talking to you guys in the comment section until next time peace